Okay, the bobbin is the thread for the bottom part of the stitch. This uh, little part of the arm will come off. Slides to the left just a little bit, a little tag, so don't force it. Uh, you take that off, one thing here is it makes this sewing arm, you got a place where you can put a small, like a, a sleeve or a, uh, a loop, sack, whatever, goes on here and go around, fit on there better. The bobbin is inside here. Okay, there's a little instruction tag you can see here shows which direction for the thread to go. There's a little tag here. I've got a spare one that, off of another machine. And it lifts uh, for you to get a hold of. It's, uh, I believe, a little bit of a clutch here, too, that holds the bobbin in place. It kind of grips it when you're putting it on and off. But you lift, lift that. There's a place here that matches this little arm that comes up. And that's where it lines up with that. Okay. Now this bobbin is a plastic one. I bought some uh, metal ones. Should be it's a class. What I found on the internet looked at it's a class 15 machine, and there's uh, well from what I've seen is for Singer or Kimmore. There's another class. I won't confuse you with that. But anyway, class 15 machine, and voila. Say that there's also universal needles. You can also get a heavy duty uh, denim for blue jean, and there's even a leather needle. But uh, I don't know if this machine have any idea on uh, something that heavy. I wouldn't think. Probably not. By the way, this thing really sews nice. But the thread in here. When you put it in, the thread is going around this way. It shows that on the little picture here. Put that in. There's a little groove here, and this is a little flat piece of metal uh, spring is what the tension. That little groove, put the thread in there and kind of pull it forward, it'll go under that little piece of metal, and it comes out in this groove here. Okay. If you get a hold of this clip then that'll hold the bobbin in while you're working with it here. Put that on the little spindle and you may have to rotate a little bit make sure it's all the way in. Then now to thread the bobbin up through the top we need to have the top part threaded also because the thread from the top will uh, go down through, they'll interlock, and it'll pull this bottom one up for you. So we'll show you threading the machine with the top, top thread next.